Dear friends of the free world, welcome to part 3 of Kuberda's 8-hour crossover strategy executed on the 4-hour with 8-hour settings. So, today, on the request of some of you, I want to discuss specifically the entry conditions, okay? So, the first thing is here, uh, a divergence, RSI divergence actually, for the buy below 50 and for the sell the divergence should be bigger 60. So we are looking back when was the last low below that range and that was here um, at 44.61 and then we have a one further back 30.18. Okay, so I mark them here with these indicators, with these lines. And so that's the first thing we're looking for. We're waiting patiently for that. So we have it here. Okay. A little bit to the side. And now we're waiting for the second condition. We just have a touch here, not a break, which would be um, a class C divergence. So we have two divergences. We have a divergence with this point, and we have a class C divergence here. So that should be sufficient when we get the other signals. So this yellow line is the smooth moving average 2. It should cross the 8, which is the bright pink line here. And it should also cross the Tenkan Sen 13, which is the violet um, step line, which is like underneath here. And also these blue crosses, which is the Kijun Sen 21. Okay, it should cross all of these back up and then we will see the other conditions. So here we have a cross. Do we want to buy this cross? That's the question. Let's see if any other conditions are um, met. The third condition is the Haikin Ashi buy sell signal Haikin 99, which we don't see. So we had, if, if it was still green, we could buy, but we had a red signal here. So we're waiting for the green signal as the third thing before we enter any trade. So let's see. There we have the green signal, and here we have also the rebreak of the line above the other lines and now actually I was a little bit fast I should have stopped here because the price can still reverse from here right so we don't want to enter here at the candle close but we rather wait for the break of that candle which I indicated here with this line and we observe that all the if conditions are also met so there RSI should have crossed the moving average which is this blue dot, uh, the red dots here. So it's above the red dots, which you cannot really see, but you know, you know, I could make it bigger. So here's the red dot, which is the moving average, and here's another one. So it's above there, okay. What else do we have? And uh, it should not be an opposite uh, divergence. So we have an opposite divergence with this point already, so that is not good. But we don't have a divergence yet with this point. So I should mark this in the chart actually. The money flow index should for a buy should not be uh, should be smaller 70. So it's just on the edge. So that's also not very convincing for a buy. 
Anti-stochastic errors I should be crossed, that is given, and it should not be at the opposite extreme, that means greater 80 or smaller 20 for a cell. Okay, so let's see what we get here. It's going down again, so that's actually the divergence between these two points playing out. Okay, and now we get the break. We have, by the way, we have the hiking by, I said that before. And now the conditions are better. The money flow is smaller. Um, all the other conditions are met. And the divergence here is cancelled because, um, well, it's not cancelled from the price, but it's already played out. Okay, so um, we can ignore this and just look for the second divergence, which is at, let me see, where is it at? Here. What's the first price? 73.92. So we shouldn't buy that anyway, because we don't buy, that's one of the other conditions, we don't buy over 70. Actually, I have to see if that's already, is it mentioned? Parasite, cause M and A, no oppositive. Oh yeah, that's one of the other conditions I didn't write down yet here. Mm -hmm. RSI has to be um, Okay, no oppositive, cross-moving average, and it has to be smaller 70 by and greater 40 for cell and it doesn't have to be in the opposite div okay so all these conditions are met so we are entering here at the cross of the previous high And boom. The thing is, when the, there are different conditions for setting the target price and stop loss, um, which is not immediately set in this strategy, so that we will discuss in the next video. So your comments and questions are most welcome. May the on love be with you. Jai Kubera. Jai Alaksh Kubera.